It's the only onion that some folks like to eat like an apple. The Vidalias are about to hit the shelves, and as Suzanne Lala reports, you may notice some subtle changes in the crop and the price this year. When springtime rolls around, the official state vegetable, the Vidalia onion, comes rolling through my kitchen. The shipping date this year is April 19th, which means you should get them in the stores by the 20th or the 21st. Farmers say they're a little bit smaller, but there will be plenty of onions this year. I'm excited. I'm ready to get it going. Aries Haygood farms 375 acres on his farm. He's also the chairman of the Vidalia Onion Committee, so he's got tabs on the crop that's known throughout the country. This year is one of those years we would check the box of it just being um, cooler than normal. Those green stems don't like that. Haygood says that stunted the growth some. You know, we're going to have, like I said, plenty of volume. Only difference, they may have to get a two and a half or three inch onion instead of that four, four and a half inch onion. Only folks in one of 20 counties can grow Vidalia onions. But Texas is a big competitor on the West Coast with their sweet onion. Haygood says the monster winter storm this year hurt the Lone Star State. That means you might see the price increase at the store this year here in Georgia. The total demand of the product uh, goes up. You may see a, a change in, in, in the retail level. You know, usually you're talking uh, nickels and dimes per pound. So you will get the onions right on time, but you may have to chunk out a little more change for the Georgia treat. Suzanne Lawler, 13 WMAZ News. And Haygood says the Vidalia Onion Festival is a go this year with country singer Rodney Atkins set to perform. This year the event will run the weekend of April 22nd through the 25th. Vidalia is located in Toombs County off I-16 about 90 miles east of Macon.